Hi, lovely one. I thought I would just share with you some of the really common blocks that people have when they have that feeling inside that they are meant for more. And quite often, it's people that have been attached to a career. You know that feeling when you've invested your life in the role that you're in. And within that is this sense of identity. You know who you are and you know how other people perceive you. And so that feels very familiar. And it can keep us a little bit trapped. Often the feeling that people come to me with is, I feel secure in that, but there's there's a part of me that's no longer being fulfilled. Uh, that spark has gone out and I know that I have more to give. I just can't keep pouring it in the same um, area of my life, whether it's a big corporation or whether it's a business. And I want to explore what it would be like, what it would feel like to live life more in, in, in my purpose. And their mind goes to, but what, what if I fail at that? What if I let go of something that I was only ever meant to do? What? And so the what if questions become more blocks than actual exploratory questions. And so if you're in that area of thinking or, or time in your life where you're curious, you have a pull towards more for yourself, where it's going to be more fulfilling for you, more purposeful, and you're in the set of what if questions that are taking you into a downward spiral and you're not answering them, I invite you to write the questions down and answer them. Answer them honestly. Then the next part, so that we've got balance and fairness, is to flip the question. So if you if your question is, what if I fail? Which is a really common one and an understandable one and one that should be uh, clarified. What if I succeed? What if you succeed? Write down the answer to that. What if now is the right time? Write down the answer to that. I know that our minds wants to keep us in our comfort zone, but I will absolutely bet my bottom dollar that it's anything but comfortable for you if you're in that space of curiosity, that when you have that feeling, that acknowledgement that you're meant for more, it becomes so uncomfortable that you have to explore it. I think our heart, our soul, if that's not too woolly, um needs to be heard and also wants to explore more purpose and meaning. And I, So if you're in that uh, season of your life where you are no, noticing a, a calling towards more for you or giving more or having more purpose or fulfillment, then I would love to hear from you. I have a Meant For More program that supports people just like you in living life in their purpose. And it's not selfish to want to do that. It's inspirational. So I'm right here when you're ready. Mm.